Last time on Apollo Justice, Ace Attorney. What if a different connection could be proven? A connection between the witness and the victim. We might find that she had a personal motive beyond wanting to help her fiance. What possible connection are you suggesting here? I'm starting to think that the police never looked inside that safe. Never looked inside the what now? <laughs> never you mind, Mrs. Stinky Prince. <laughs> None of your business. Miss Tiala, who testified you had no connection to the victim. And I don't. I quit half a year ago, didn't I? So, there's no connection. You left your job at the Marectus Clinic, true. But you remain connected somehow. This chart was found inside a safe in the doctor's office. Why would this one chart be in that safe? You know why it was, don't you? You knew about Walkie's failed operation. You were in the same position as Dr. Maractus. Kinda makes it hard to claim no connection, doesn't it? Too bad, little attorney. Uh, the palpitations again. <laughs> oh god, I'm finally having a heart attack from all the caffeine! <laughs> <laughs> not now, not now! My bracelet's reacting again. Look, there's the glowy halo again, Apollo! <laughs> <laughs> so it is. <laughs> oh, I love this part when I perceive and it... Ah! Why would I go to the clinic for a half-year-old chart now, you ask? You know why you'd go now, don't you? It was a clear and present threat. That's ridiculous. Why, if that were the case, I would have had six months to do something about it. Which means something happened, something to make that chart a problem for you now. The Katakis are trying to get out of the business. The health checkup this month was their first ever. You knew what Walkie's chest x way wag 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 Yo, 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 What the chest x-way would reveal? You knew what Walkie's chest x-ray chest My god. <laughs> you say nothing happened in the doctor's office. This bullet was stuck inside the doctor's safe. Uh oh. Inside the safe? Fabia's like, I spent hours trying to guess the code. I tried wasted. one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Then I tried my birthday. I tried my mother's <laughs> birthday. <laughs> The pistol was taken from the Kitaki Mansion that day. If the marks on this bullet match the murder weapon, then that proves a firearm was discharged in that office on the day of the murder. Hello, and welcome to another episode of Disillusion Plays Apollo Justice Ace Attorney, where we play the games and do the voices. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your contribution there, Taylor. I'm Pete. I'm Sarah. And I'm Taylor. <laughs> nice. Partially distracted, Taylor. That's it. <laughs> Where did you go? Did you go somewhere nice then, Taylor? <laughs> <laughs> yes. I was on, I was in a field, sky clad. Well. Underneath an oak tree. <laughs> so, under, <laughs> under an oak tree. I, I enjoy, by the way, that someone pointed out in the comments that skyclad means naked, which, you know, is just... <laughs> that's an image. Did, yeah, very, did you, that's an image. Very wordsmith, yeah. Did you, did you say skyclad, or was it a dialogue? To, I can't remember if, if it was just you randomly just coming out with that, or if it is what no, wordsmith, wordsmith said. No, wordsmith said He actually clad. said it. <laughs> wordsmith said wordsmith it. Wordsmith said it, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. wow. <laughs> It wasn't just Taylor being the horny well, for once. Well, I mean, in that case, it, it, it kind of fits in with the canon of him being a sex pest, doesn't it, really? <laughs> it does if a little bit. If he's sky clad everywhere. Sky clad. Sky -clad. <laughs> Free as a bird. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> it is important to show the women what they are missing. <laughs> yeah. Leave it to their imagination, surely. <laughs> Wouldn't she have uh, taken the chart? Oh. You s do you <laughs> <laughs> do you see, baby? <laughs> do you see, baby? God, that short wouldn't have been left in that safe. <laughs> he, oh, he's right. No, I think you'll find I'm clavier. Damn it, stinky handsome prince! Did it again. <laughs> <laughs> you foiled again, Miss Chiala. Uh, yes. 
is clear to this court as you are not a very good fiance. <laughs> wow! Well, the judge just like throwing the shade in immediately. I mean, wow! I mean, I, mean, I suppose he yeah. is right. He's though. got a point. <laughs> Straight to the point, it judge. Is, it is quite amusing him just calling her out like that, though. <laughs> it's like again with with Albert Wesker. It's like he is not a very nice man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm flattered. Mm. Ditto. <laughs> Perhaps it is time you told us the truth. Tell us about yourself, including your actions and the whereabouts on that day. Oh, Don't well, forget! Um, I like long walks on the beach, uh, I enjoy fashion, and I also enjoy taking vast amounts of money from unsuspecting dimwits for my own purposes. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Tiala, we're in court right now. You can't be blurting out things like that in the in the middle of the session. You're not in a beauty pageant now. <laughs> no. So don't forget, we've proven that you were that you were at the Maractus Clinic on the day of the crime. Mm. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's right. We've proven that you were there. It's the sideways one that's not very flattering. No, it's no, it's. Yes, I went to the clinic that day to speak to the doctor. I wanted that chart, but I failed to get it, so I went back to the clinic later. So maybe she is who we bumped into then. Mm. In any case, I didn't shoot him. You don't even have proof I stole that pistol, do you? Oh, that's the one. And that uh. brat was spotted in the park at the moment of the crime. Frankly, I don't think it matters if Dr. Maractus was shot in the temple or not. You went back later? That chart was dangerous, you understand? I needed to get rid of it. That's why I went that day. <laughs> Objection, why are you laughing? Your... Objection, Your Honor! It's devastating to my case! <laughs> <laughs> but you couldn't get the chart then, could you? And later that night, Dr. Maractus was shot. By me. <clears throat> I mean... <laughs> Wait, who said that? I mean... <laughs> I heard about the shooting, waited a day, but then I had to go back. No easy feat with the cops all over the place. Ah, uh, that... that was you? Mm. Bump. <gasps> uh, uh, Apollo! That sound! It came from behind this door! Ah, uh, called it. Someone's in there. Get a break in. I left through that window. So you were the burglar. Uh, that was you two. If only I had one more minute. Then I could have opened the safe and gotten the chart. What? That's trespassing and brazen at that. <laughs> Oh, is this a trial for trespassing now? <laughs> Besides, you can't blame a girl for wanting to protect herself. <laughs> there are gangsters, or they are gangsters, you know. They are gangsters, you know. <laughs> In any case, Mr. Justice, your cross-examination. I guess this is this is notably different than with Dahlia because I guess she's not quite as cute because the judge was falling over himself to protect Dahlia back. <laughs> yeah, then. yeah, yeah. 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 Really not so <laughs> with her. Yeah, but I mean, she's being quite obvious though, isn't she? Maybe, That's the thing. maybe he's learnt his lesson. <laughs> maybe <laughs> this judge gave him a walloping. <laughs> <laughs> Admitting the love. Oh, I saw the way that you were looking at that young strumpet. Come yes. over here, whack, whack. <laughs> Oh, no, Mrs. Judge, it wasn't <laughs> like that. <laughs> Full on Mr. and Mrs. Garadab. Oh, God. <laughs> Admitting the little crime to avoid the big one, huh? In the words of Bob Marley, I shot the sheriff, but I didn't shoot. Wait, no, that's admitting to a worse crime. <laughs> Never mind. That's the opposite of what I want to do. Okay, she went to the clinic to speak to the doctor. She wanted the job, but she failed to get it, so she went back later. Anyway, she didn't shoot him. We don't have proof that she, she stole the pistol. And Bwaki was spotted in the park at the moment of the crime. Frankly, she doesn't think it matters if it was shot in the temple or not. Okay, so I guess we'll do the usual. Hold it! Why that day? That brat was uncontrollable. He was ready to kill. 
And that would bring in the police. And that chart would become evidence. And I'd be hung out to dry. You're really bad at fake crying. You I know that? I was gonna say, I'm like, I don't know if you were like trying at all, but like it just there, she was just, she really just did not sound convincing. Like she was trying to sort of put on anything. I it mean, was just do you like, think she oh would? no. Yeah, no, she was, I, I'm, I'm kind of imagining it's that like, it's just like a barely veiled. Yeah, yeah it's like, yeah. oh, and I'd be hung out to dry. <laughs> <laughs> Feel sorry for me, please. <laughs> Sorry, I did not mean to kill him. Oh no, I admitted to it. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh no. But the police didn't check the safe, did they? Well, they thought the crime scene was the park. I'll make sure the responsible parties feel the heat. Oh no, pal. Such sloppiness <laughs> won't be tolerated, ya. Oh, I'm kind of thankful for that sloppiness myself, actually. Hold it! Later? Later. Later? Later. L later? <laughs> when I heard what happened, well, I was too scared to do anything that day. Or do anything that day. So I waited until the day after. The 16th, was it? Of course, you and that meddling kid and your... I feel like you should have a dog, but <laughs> you and that meddling kid... Kid had to get in my way. And our and our and our Emma snacks. Our snackoos. No, snackoos. <laughs> you, snackoos. Emma, do you want some snackoos? <laughs> 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 but why did Dr. Baractus keep that chart around? It was clearly dangerous for him. Could have burned it. Because he's a coward. The chart was his insurance. Insurance? Yeah, you know that thing you have to pay through the nose for, or otherwise you die from an easily preventable medical condition? <laughs> uh, I wouldn't know, actually. I'm British, so... <laughs> we don't have that oh. kind of thing. <laughs> we have insurance for different things. <laughs> like paying for your car if you get scratched. I mean, you're supposed to have scratched. life insurance, I suppose. <laughs> well, I thought you said wife insurance for a second. <laughs> See, uh, for like, a second minute. there, me too, but... Life no. insurance. L. There was a... Wife there was, insurance. There was a definite L in there. Wife <laughs> insurance. <laughs> Wife insurance. <laughs> if your spouse falls off of a cliff what? for mysterious reasons, we will provide you with a new wife absolutely free of charge. <laughs> Let's continue playing Apollo Justice Ace Attorney. Pete's going to need insurance in a oh. minute. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. He's gonna now, now, there's no insurance. husband insurance. <laughs> no killing, please. <laughs> no killing the husband. <laughs> It's going to be uh, Sarah with the lead a, pipe in the kitchen. The wet pipe in the kitchen. <laughs> it's another rolling she, pad in the kitchen. Where she'll have a, rolling she'll, pad. Rolling pad. Rolling pad. pad. And what the hell is a rolling <laughs> pad? <laughs> that was be, a combination of pad and rolling pad. Oh, my God. You'll have to be careful or you will suffer a wife sentence. <laughs> a wife sentence? <laughs> oh, my God. Really? A wife sentence. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. I hate you. I hate Aww. you. I hate you both. Go away. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> I'm a little bit. No, you're not. I'm a little bit. <laughs> we'll submit to the punishment of the rolling pan. The woeing pan. <laughs> My signature on that chart, to be more specific. That made sure I couldn't betray him. I didn't shoot him. Hold it! You could have stolen it. Could have. <laughs> Is this some new definition of proof? We'll ask Walkie. He'll tell us. No, he won't. Objection! <laughs> might I remind you this is a cross-examination? You might want to keep your baseless theories to yourself. <laughs> He's right, isn't he? Yeah, baby. <laughs> Hold it! Yeah, but, um... But what? You have nothing to say. This case is over. It was over the moment that brat was seen in the park. What's the point in dragging it out any further? We're going to have to use the shoes. The shoes. Yeah, and the... Was the, the shoes, oh, there's, the, there was the bullet in the safe as well. There is... 
Um, in the case, I didn't shoot him. You don't have any proof. I went back to... <sighs> well, have, let's check the doctor. court record, shall we? I mean, we haven't pressed this statement. Do we, should we, well, let's press the final yeah, statement. Let's press first. the statement, yeah. Hold it! The doctor was shot in the right temple. Yes? I don't know what the intonation is there. So it seems... Doctor. Let's review the facts again, shall we? For the slower section of the class. <laughs> if the killer shot from this location, the bullet would have struck our victim square on the forehead. However, the entry wound was in the right temple. Yes, we heard testimony on this yesterday. At the time of the shooting, the witness was standing here. Just before the gun was fired, he shouted. The victim turned his head to look and was shot. Objection! But that testimony was proven to be a lie! Hmm. Our egregious panty snatcher, Mr. Stickler, did witness the crime. But he was standing to the north, next to the trash can where he tossed those panties. If Mr. Stickler shattered from this location, the bullet couldn't hit his right temple. Ah, uh, silly, silly attorney. But what? Do you remember what you had for breakfast that morning? Do you? Oh, oh sorry. Do, was gonna do you remember, Trucy? I always have a glass of milk for breakfast. What matters is one thing. The doctor was shot in his right temple. If that's the case, there can only be one explanation. The panties guy was mistaken. Objection! But his location was proven! You can't write that off as him being mistaken! Objection! Oh, God. Then why don't you show us hair forehead? Uh, show you... what? Must I explain everything? Very well, let's recap. Throw a little safety save here, folks. <laughs> what are you doing? Hold no, on. Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing! If the witness, Panties Guy, was standing to the north, then where was the shooter standing? From what location did the killer shoot the victim? But wait! If the witness was standing there, how could anyone shoot the victim in the right temple? Because there was another gunman right behind him. <laughs> uh, I merely laid out the facts for us. Well, actually, if... I guess it depends. If he turned his head, though, then the only thing to the... You know, if eliminate the impossible, only the possible... You know, only whatever remains has to be the truth, right? So if he if he turned to face Stickler and Stickler was to the north, then his right temple would be facing the inside of the cart. Mm. Yeah. So is it possible that the gunman or gunwoman or gun person was in the cart? Hmm. Could be in the cart, could be another person. I guess if he... It could be behind Actually, Stickler, but it depends on the shouting bit. Because I thought the yeah, whole I thing that's was... true. I think he shouted, the guy turns his head, then the bolt, then the shot rang out, right? Mm -hmm. So at that yeah. point, you'd have to be looking north, so then the, the gunshot would have to have come from the direction of the cart. The shot was coming from inside the noodles. Yeah. <laughs> the noodles. It's up to the one possessing the shiny forehead to show us. If you can, that is. Monkey Kataki was standing at the killer mark. Wesley Stickler at the witness mark. All I have to do and is move where Waki was standing. Because if he's not standing on the killer mark anymore, the then he can't be the God, killer. God damn intrusive thoughts. It's really hard to think <laughs> when I've got all these other voices in my head. <laughs> and of course, of course, of course. Of course. Shut up. And of course, he's Hello. from Jersey. Of course! God, hey, hey, oh, what? Sh shut up, voices! I'm walking here! Hey! <laughs> and of course, <laughs> Palmaractus was at the victim mark. Let's hear what the defense has to say. Uh, um. 
<laughs> are you doing? Are you? No, 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 no. Like, Where was the killer standing when they shot the victim? Has to be someplace else. Someplace else. Has the facts has the facts stand now? We can't explain this crime without contradicting ourselves at some point. But I know why. The real killer shot from enti the real killer shot from an entirely different location. What are you talking about? I don't see any other place. Apparently, Mr. Justice does. Let's hear it. Uh, this is gonna be. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Time to put your evidence where your mouth is, Pete. I mean, I don't have evidence to say that it happened. It's just that it's just like where else? It's in it the be? noodle yeah. cart. Yeah, that's what I think. Where in the park did the killer shoot the victim from? <laughs> Objection! <laughs> it's time to raise the roof. And the stakes. Wait, what are you actually objecting to at this point? Yeah. Huh? The penalties are such frightening things, don't you think? Oh, is it gonna like wipe it out entirely? <laughs> but uh, what if they were a bit more terrifying? Um, um, what? Dude? What, what are you? What are you? <laughs> oh he's doing that really uncool thing again <laughs> like so d double penalty therefore had wishes to take us in a new direction then he must be ready for the challenges ahead challenge accepted <laughs> Challenge accepted! It's just his time. He's, be <laughs> he's beginning to morb. He's beginning to justice. Are you sure, Paul? The key is the witness. Mr. Stickler's testimony. If we believe that, then we know where he stood. And the victim turned when he shouted. There's only one place the killer could have been. The killer shot the victim from here. Doink. Take that! I believe we all owe a debt of gratitude to Miss Alita Tiala. Well, um, what do you mean? Well, thanks to you, we had a chance to review the crime. And this time, we were prepared. We know that Wesley Stickler was telling the truth. We should have listened to him from the beginning. <laughs> oh. Wesley Stickler was standing next to the trash can when he saw the two men. They're <laughs> really getting their money's worth out of this 3D stuff. <laughs> <laughs> halt! <laughs> <laughs> he shouted just as he shouted just as he told us in his testimony. Halt! And the victim turned to look in his direction. A shot was fired. The victim was hit in the right temple. Oh, oh. Oh, yes. Which direction was his, bleh, which direction was his right temple facing at that moment? That's right, toward the noodle stand. Oh. Order, order, order. So you're saying. The killer was inside the noodle stand? I mean, that is what... It, it would seem that way, wouldn't it? Objection! Uh, let's think about this a bit more, shall we? You say the killer was inside the noodle stand. Which would mean the victim, Dr. Maractus, came to the park... ...wheeling his own murderer in the cart behind him. I mean, I feel like he probably didn't know she was in there. Mm. Hey, hey, what do you mean she? How do you know it's a she? It could be anyone. <laughs> this is the most ridiculous thing I have ever heard. I would think you'd notice if you were pulling someone along. Objection! There's something we should worry about before that. Why was he pulling the noodle stand in the first place? Objection! Uh, let's deal with our problems one at a time, shall we? Someone was hiding in the stand. We have not come this far to talk about possibilities. Let's talk about proof, baby. 
Show us evidence that proves someone was in that stand. Well, so the only thing I can think of that we have got is we do have the footprint of the slipper, right? Mm-hmm. And that was, that was outside the noodle stand. I mean, it was yeah. kind of at the side, kind of. I think. What does the slipper say? Uh, slippers, big toe print found. Or oh, do we not have evidence for it? We, we definitely. Oh crap! Because I remember doing it. We, we, because there were the footprints around the, the there were the various sort yeah. of footprints around it, around the car at the crime scene, and we, one of them, was uh, the bottom of the slippers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The With leaf. the leaf print, it had a leaf print on it. Then obviously these have got this here. Mm. I mean, maybe this is actually what we need. Um, but it wasn't like behind it though, was it? I it think was it, at the side. Yeah, it was kind of like at the bottom. Well, they could've, it could have been like when they walked round. They just yeah, stepped maybe. in a muddy bit. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. uh, not, <laughs> just like What's play. the matter, Justice? <laughs> Having a bit of uh, low confidence? Uh, no. <laughs> okay. Can I prove that? You want evidence that someone was in the stand? Well, well too, too bad. bad. <laughs> too bad. Uh, I don't think we can prove someone was in it. Not in it, in it. It could prove someone maybe got out of it, but uh, we'd need to look at the noodle cart. Really? Not actually, like physically look at it. Like inside. Yeah. What? <laughs> just, just a, a Apollo juggling. Just there. juggling the noodle cart. <laughs> <laughs> like, How does one get into the stand? Yeah, I mean that is a good question, isn't it? Through the curtain in the front. <laughs> I mean that is what it looks like, isn't it? Oh, I don't know. Too bad. Gonna too I'm going to say too bad, but I don't think... this probably We're going to get penalized, I bet. Mm. Well, too bad! Mm. <laughs> 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 kidding! <laughs> Just kidding! I've got it! <laughs> Close one. <laughs> And let's see it. Show us proof that someone was hiding in the noodle stand. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> I guess it is the slip. It's, it's got to be, gotta right? Be, I've got to be the slip. It's got to be. Take that! Oh, okay. <laughs> For a second, the music didn't stop or anything, and I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> the Maractus Clinic. And they're covered with paint. What? That's probably not a good way to open with it. It's weird that, he just, <laughs> weird that he's just given no context. Like, the Maractus Clinic, and they're <laughs> covered with paint. I mean, he's reading what's yeah, on I it. I mean, but, fantastic. Yeah. What are you? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> These slippers were found in a trash can near the crime scene. Near the oh, crime scene. okay. You got back to the point after you went around the house. As well. <laughs> <laughs> and a single slipper print was found at the scene. Yeah, right. Okay, mm -hmm. in front of the wheel. Right next to the noodle stand. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Miss Tiala, your toe print was found in the left slipper. <laughs> in other words, this is proof you were inside that noodle stand. Boom. Ah! Objection. <laughs> Yet there was only one slipper mark found at the scene. Can this be called a footprint in good faith? Objection! <laughs> Observe the diagram. A part pathway runs right next to the slipper mark. A slipper wouldn't leave a a slipper wouldn't leave a trace on a cobblestone path. Objection! Ah! Yet you still cannot say this is a footprint, yeah? Why not? You have an impression left by a single slipper. What if it was on the stand and simply fell on the ground? Uh, objection! That's... Uh, that's just dumb! One more thing. A noodle stand is typically cluttered with the tools of the noodle-making trade. There's no room for a person to ride in there. Uh. How do you... How do you... Serve the stuff then if there's not room for a person in the family. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta get inside the stand to make the noodles! <laughs> you have a point. Would someone have hidden in that stand? 
It's just got to use like a big pair of metal tongs to just like keep reaching in and like <laughs> moving, the, shuffle, shuffling the pans around and turn, turning the heat up and down. And then he serves them again with the tongs. Mm. Apollo! I think it. Oh, sorry. Apollo! I think I might be onto something. Huh? I think I figured out one of our pieces of evidence. In order to make room in the stand, some things would have to be. What? What? Well, what? Mr. Justice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the stuff one strapped to the arm. roof. What? That's just rude. Stop interrupting me, old grumpy <laughs> man, Judge. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mr. Justice. Taylor, did you say something about the roof? Yes. Remember how there's a bunch of salt boxes and everything that are tied crudely to the roof? Yes. Mm. Maybe. Do you have proof that someone could have hidden in the stand? <laughs> we also have the noodle bowl. Is there anything on that? When it, because he said this is all, this is all I have left. I mean, there's the face, <clears throat> and the face again. Pete's face. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Taylor. Editing Pete when he's got a lot of edits to do. <laughs> I, I can prove one thing: someone did scheme to clear space in that stand. Uh, it's the cot. You think so? I get. Take that! I don't see how that evidence relates to the matter at hand. Oh, that. Wait, was, really? That wasn't it. Oh, maybe if I submit it's another piece of evidence while he's thinking. Stop right there! I think someone's scheming to avoid a penalty. Uh, no, no, there, nope, nope. <laughs> Never happened. That one was invented by a writer. Okay. I guess it is the bowl then. Let's try. I guess you just carry salt on the roof then, as you Take do. Take that! This, well done, Sarah. This is a noodle bowl from the stolen Eldoon's Noodles noodle stand. Because I forgot that's God, a try, mouthful. Try saying that quickly. <laughs> Eldoon's Noodle Noodle Stand. Eldoon's Noodle Noodle Stand. <laughs> <laughs> Eldoon's Noodles Noodle Stand. Yep. Yes, and what about it? We discovered a large quantity of these bowls yesterday. Oh, they're in the clinic, of course! Oh! Yes! Oh. Of course. Yes, sir. I thought, I thought, I th I was getting mixed up with thinking Eldoon said, like, this is all I have left, I can't find the rest of my bowls and stuff. But yeah, I forgot they're actually at the bloody clinic. Yep. <laughs> in the lobby of the Maractus Clinic! <laughs> I probably should have put those somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> a large quantity of noodle bowls at the victim's clinic. Mr. Eldoon was very clear about those bowls. <laughs> well, I don't care who did it. Without that stand, I'm finished. All my noodle bowls were in there too. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> That's what he said. Hmm. Yet the bowls were removed. That night, there was space inside that noodle stand. Do space take up that much space, though. I feel like that <laughs> Not that really many. Yeah, just... Space created at the Maractus Maractus Clinic, no less. Right around the time that you were there, Miss Alita Tiala. Stop! <laughs> this is devastating to my case. Uh... I won't listen to any more of these wild fantasies. No, not not fantasies. <laughs> True. <laughs> They're worse lies than that spoiled brat's pickup lines! Oh no. I would like to remind the witness of her current status. This court does not consider you entirely <laughs> innocent. Show me an innocent. Er, <clears throat> show me an innocent. I'll show you a fairy tale. What? Um. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> you mean an innocent? In any case, the defense has somehow made its point. Yes, and we got enough exercise going around all of those houses, through the river, <laughs> over the dell, over the cliff, back up again, oh, and now somehow back that? to the original point. For Mr. God's sake, Stinky man. Prince, just shut up. Just know when to <laughs> shut up, man. <laughs> Stop being so rude. <laughs> Don't make me come over there. <laughs> <laughs> Slap you with Mr. Hat. <laughs> I'm go! Kick him in the shin. <laughs> <laughs> I challenge you to uh, a duel. Like, I take my gloves off to you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> the witness had both a motive and an opportunity to kill Dr. Baractus. Don't make Mr. Hat bite his thumb at you. <laughs> More 
fairy tales. This whole trial is a fairy tale. Well, you're the one with the weird outfit. Mm -hmm. Then please pull us back down to you're reality, out of order. You're out of order. This whole court's out of order. <laughs> I beg your pardon. I'm the only one who pours water here. You shut up. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> I'm giving you one last chance to explain yourself. This is it. No more chances after this, you hear me? Uh, Apart from that one extra chance that I might give you if I'm in a good mood <laughs> still. <laughs> actually, I mean, it's more like three or four, actually, but, but still. <laughs> after another three or four, I'm going to have to give you a very stern warning that I will have to warn you again if you I'm, continue to abuse the chances I have given you. I'm going to have to smack your bottom for being a naughty oh, girl. Oh, no, that's illegal, pal. <laughs> what? What did you say? <laughs> oh, I knew you. Oh, you're off trying to tap women on the bottoms, aren't you, you dirty old man? Come <laughs> over here. Yes, judges, I'll hit you with the rolling, rolling pin, pin no. again. No, not the rolling pin, please, no. Uh, um, I was, like, really confused for a second there. Okay. <laughs> Why was Dr. Maractus pulling that stand that night? What was Alita Tiala doing inside it? Time to get to the bottom of this case. Witness testimony. Yeah, I am curious about the car. <laughs> like why he was pulling it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <sighs> that night, I went to ask Dr. Maractus for the chart. I had no intention of ever letting that chart fall into the Kotaku family's hands. But Dr. Maractus didn't understand. For some reason, he thought the Katakis had sent me. So, I gave up and went home. All I did was talk to him. You knew about the botched operation. So you tried to get rid of the chart to save yourself. I won't make excuses. And I did warn the good doctor. I gave him a chance. I told him that Brat got his health checkup report. And that he was coming to settle the score. Hmm. I see. Very well. Mr. Justice, begin your cross-examination. Hmm. Yes, Your Honor. This is the last testimony. You hope. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> Either I perceive the truth, or, I, or it's... <laughs> He's beginning to perceive. Or, <laughs> God damn it. Or it's over. <laughs> perceive. <laughs> Stupid, handsome, stinky prince. <laughs> okay, went to ask Ooh. for the child. Ooh, the I had no intention of... Mike, this looks like a pose that could have a fidget. Mm. I don't think this one will. I don't think this one will. I think it's this Fail one. Or she, is probably, be like yeah. twitching with a It's scarf. her fingers or something, mm. right? Let's try this one. So, I see. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I had no intention ever letting that chart. Hmm. No. no, I think I feel like it's, uh, uh, I feel well, like it's she when she said she went home. Yeah. yeah, when she said she didn't do anything yeah, else. Yeah, because she she definitely didn't want it to fall into their their hands. So I think this. Yeah, one no, I think it's the whatever room. the statement. I think it might be the next statement where it's like I, you know, all I did was go home. Yeah, no, yeah. I know. I just wanted to double check because I, I, like I say, I don't think it'll be this sprite. I think yeah, it'll be this I one. think it's this yeah, one. It's gotta yeah. be this one. Okay. Gave up. And went home. Aha! Aha! Yep. Gotcha! <laughs> Welcome to the Shadow Realm, baby! <laughs> All I did was Wait, talk what? and lie. Just, what? What? Show me proof! Pretty sure about this one. I think I'm getting the hang of this. A little slip in confidence, and they give it all away. The proof is you, Miss Tiala. Hmm? All I did was talk to him, you claim. Yet you can't hide your own nervous... <clears throat> Yet you can't hide your own nervous twitch when you say those words. Was that a voice crack? Are you Maybe. Or something? Maybe. <laughs> 
Stop it! <laughs> My Twitch? What are you talking about? Isn't that like what people stream on? <laughs> you, uh, I have no idea. You have a habit of scratching the area around the neck. Wait. You have a habit of scratching the area of your neck around the edge of your scarf. What? 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 Uh, this is barking better than I'd hoped. Her unconscious actions tell the truth she won't say. Habits and lies. Two dots. Connect the dots and find the truth. D don't, don't look at me like that. I, d d I told you the truth. It seems that when you recall what really happened in that office, you can't keep your hands off your neck, can you? Oh, did he, like, strangle her or something, maybe? <laughs> well, grab her by the throat, I mean, or something. Or the scarf, I guess. Just, it's just could be a nervous, yeah. I mean, it could be, yeah. Huh. It seems that, hmm, it seems that nervous habits are unconscious reactions that manifest when someone is trying to hide something. Oh, thank you very much, Dr. Sigmund, but can we uh, get to the point? <laughs> you can't hide behind your scarf, Miss Tiala. Something happened between you and the victim in the Maractus Clinic office. <laughs> and I've got proof that shows us exactly what happened. We have. Is it the up. bullet in the safe? It's gotta be. Squished. The muffin. The forbidden muffin. muffin. The muffin. The forbidden muffin. Take that! I knew you were bluffing. Uh, 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 huh? I can tell by the way you fondled your spiky hair. <laughs> she found my habit. I'd better rethink this. Oh no, the credibility. Okay, we found the light, uh, the lamp. Yeah. When we found the Maractus Clinic office, there were signs of a struggle and a bullet in the safe. Yeah, yeah, we know, Apollo! Miss Tiala was willing to do anything to get that chart. So something happened. But what? Are you for real? Is the bullet... No uh, you can't hide behind your scarf. If it's the lamp and not the freaking bullet in the safe. I guess the lamp is so neatly placed. Oh, but it, the cord. There was red oh, on the cord. Of course, Maybe yes. he did try uh, and strangle it, or, oh, or vice versa. Oh, yeah. Take that! What? What's that? You're touching your scarf again. Mm. There's something unusual about this lamp. The uh, bulb is broken. tacky? <laughs> <laughs> the bulb is broken. And there's a red splotch on the cord. Huh? Seeing how you hide your neck... I think I can come up with a plausible explanation for the lamp's state. Well, spit it out! This talking in circles nonsense is killing me. Very well. The answer is very simple. Miss Alita Tiala, please remove your scarf. Uh huh? Uh, 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 <laughs> well, I guess we can come out of the Shadow Realm now then. <laughs> Objection! Oh, not you two. <laughs> this is a trial to determine what happened to that park. Yet we seem to have drifted off target. Objection! We'll find out soon enough if we're drifting. What, this... because what, Deja Vu is going to be playing? <laughs> Absolutely! <laughs> Actually, it'd be more like gas, gas, gas. But anyway, <laughs> as soon as the witness removes her scarf... I... I won't do it! This is insane! I'm a... Uh, uh, an unrelated third party! Yeah, yeah, right. You can't order me to remove my... Miss Tiala, I'm afraid you've forgotten what's already been proven. What? You're hardly unrelated. Please remove your scarf. Damn. No! No! Uh -oh. oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. So, I was right, wasn't I, Miss Alita Tiala? Why does he have to say Alita Tiala? Miss Alita Tiala? Oh. oh. Your neck! That isn't what I think it is. I slipped when I was applying lipstick. Uh -uh. Something did happen that night at the Maractus Clinic. 
You needed to get that chart back no matter what it took. Even if you had to steal your fiance's pistol to do it. But, but wait! Looking at this lamp and the witness's neck, it looks like the very opposite happened. Exactly! The victim in the clinic that night was this witness. Specifically, you, specifically, you tried to threaten Dr. Maractus and he attacked you. That's what happened that night at the Maractus Clinic. <laughs> okay, her dress tried to fly away? Yeah. Where did all the oh. feathers come from? It's the, 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 it's the dress. dress. She's got like the big the wings on her dress and they were flapping. Oh, yeah. Did you, did you not realize that was... Okay. <laughs> order! 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 Will someone please tell me what really happened? I told you the truth already. I went to the clinic that night to warn Dr. Maractus. Yeah. <laughs> yes, warn him. That face. And then he had that face on, and at that point, Your Honor, I just kind of had to shoot him. <laughs> that gangster knows everything. He's coming for you. Looks like my clinic's seen its last patient. We have to get rid of that chart. Quick, open your safe. Give it to me. So you can save your own skin? What? I know what you're up to. You want in with the family. And if they see that chart, you're finished. <sighs> Leaving me holding the short straw. But if I'm going down, I'll want some company. You! And what happened next? <sighs> he jumped at me and knocked me to the floor. Then he took that cord. <laughs> oh my oh, god. Oh, Jesus. Palmaractus was serious. Deadly serious. Jesus. This is full on nightmare fuel. Mm. He really tried to strangle me. I. I must have blacked out. Hmm. Oh, did he take the noodle cup oh, to try boy. and get rid of her then? Oh, what? Okay. And then she woke up and shot him. Yeah. Maybe. Huh. So, you were the victim. And the red splotch on the cord was your li lipstick. I told you it looked I... like a lip mark. Yeah. I suppose that's true. We did say it looked like a lip mark. Well, well by we, you mean I. <laughs> the right royal we there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Th anyway, it so. was me. <laughs> don't you try and take oh, ownership God, of it? Oh God, here we go. <laughs> I was like, that looks like lipstick. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I. I didn't want to remember that night. That's why I didn't bring it up. There. Are you happy now? Uh. I was out cold, almost killed, and you claim I then snuck into that noodle stand. But how could I? Look at that face. <laughs> well, one thing is clear. We now know what really happened at the Maractus Clinic. It would seem that our victim was not entirely without blame himself. I... I'm sorry. I get so nervous just thinking of it. It's, it's hard to breathe. I've told you everything. Can I go home now? Don't do it. You bear some responsibility for events that day, true. Yet if you were also a victim, this court would owe you some sympathy. Yeah. Well, Mr. Justice, I believe this clears up the remaining questions for Miss Tiara. Yeah. When did this happen? Suddenly everyone's sympathizing with her. I don't know what to think anymore, Apollo. I mean, is that it? 
Do we know everything we need to know about Miss Tiala? Very well. This finishes the cross-examination of this. Objection! Objection. Oh. Uh, what? Oh, okay, he's at it again. <laughs> Not so fast. This party's just getting started. Now we rock. Oh, he's got the ghetto blaster going again. <laughs> uh, what? I said now we rock. Uh, okay. Those uh, spikes on your head are softer than they look. Or do you not have the stomach to go all the way? I I I'm not sure I th I know how to feel about that question <laughs> I right don't now. Know what you're Trucy, implying. Trucy, can you can you help me out here? I um, suddenly feel really uncomfortable with the way he's looking at me. Um, you know something, Apollo? Whoa, what? <laughs> Apollo's like slowly I shrinking think down the behind. I Stinky Prince likes you. No! <laughs> no! I think he likes I don't, you. I don't. No, 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 Trucy. No, I I won't hear it. Have I you won't seen hear the it. look in his eyes? I won't <laughs> hear it! That's just that's just a look of sheer vengeance. He no, wants to boil me look, alive! That looks like a look of pure lust to he, me! He, <laughs> the, the burning sensation in his eyes is because he wants to set me on fire! I he think, wants to douse me I in fuel! I think more of a burning sensation in his loins. No! <laughs> Stop <laughs> saying those things, Trucy! <laughs> I can't take it! You asked me to tell no, you the truth, I didn't so ask I you to agree with him! Look, Apollo, I've already told you. What? I can read people, and I know what he's thinking. <laughs> and I cannot repeat well, it. <laughs> well, well, we did establish that I was better at reading people than you are, and so I well, read I that still that's have not the case. I, I disagree! <laughs> What on earth is going on with the defense? You having uh, fun over there? <laughs> no, no, no. My God, Prosecutor Gavin, stop! <laughs> stop arousing the defense! <laughs> stop with this sexual tension! <laughs> Palmaractus choked Alita to help. She fell unconscious. <laughs> but what happened next? He's right. The stinky prince is right. <laughs> <laughs> There's more that we don't know. But she was choked hard enough to leave that mark. She would have been out for a while. He could have done it to herself. Uh, I mean, that's good. <laughs> it's kind of theory. difficult. Wait a minute. To, <laughs> just a game theory. <laughs> it's kind of difficult to strangle yourself, though, right? Mm -hmm. Even still. What oh, if it wasn't her Pete. in that noodle stand? Pete, Pete, Pete. Poor naive Pete. Oh, Taylor's now going to sort of bring on some random sh stuff about auto asphyxiation. Uh -oh. uh, auto asphyxiation, I imagine. Yeesh. Is that yep. where you're going with that? Mm. That's correct. Okay, fine. I guess those people are, are, are able to do that. I imagine it would be difficult. That being said, it's not something that I want to really get into or think about. <laughs> Lita Tiala, half dead, half dead, half. Half dead. Alita Tiala, half, half dead. Half dead. Dr. Maractis pulling that stand. Alita Tiala, half dead. <laughs> Dr. Maractis pulling that stand. I don't know, Cockney and Apollo is kind of funny. <laughs> good for you. And a bullet fired from inside the noodle stand. What if it's all true? We might have already figured out what truly happened that night. Miss Alita Tiala, as you can see, we're not through with you just yet. You really want to blame me for this murder, don't you? You too, Prosecutor Gavin. More like Prostitutor. No. Uh, oh! Uh, me? Fräulein, I only wish to know the truth. Well, let's go back over what we've learned up until now. On the day of the murder, Waki saw his checkup report, from which he learned about the bullets still inside him. So, he took a pistol from the family stash, with the intent to give Dr. Maractus some of his own medicine. And Miss Tiala heard about this from Waki, so she went to the Maractus clinic ahead of him, in order to get rid of the chart with her signature. But then, something happened. <sighs> 
Sounds like you figured it all out. But remember, I was the victim. I was out cold. But what about Dr. Maractus? That does seem to be the problem. He had just strangled Alita Tiala. Perhaps he thought to death. What did he do after his crime? I was just knocked out, not dead! Oh my god, as well. So wait, 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 wait. So by putting her in the noodle stand and then wheeling that out into the park, yeah. that is putting the blame, it's obviously putting the blame on Eldoon Eldoon. as well. Yeah. And obviously they had the ongoing yeah. feud. Yeah. So it'd be yet like yet another thing. And oh it's literally God. next door, which could explain why all the pots and pans could be taken out and shoved in the. Yep. Yep. Wow. Um, what an asshole. The, sho the shoes. Why did he swap his shoes though? That's the weird thing. Mm. Hmm. I said I was just knocked out, not dead. From the state of his clinic and the scene in the park. I think it's clear what the good doctor did next. Well, hair forehead, care to guess? <clears throat> well, Mr. Justice, what did Dr. Baractus do? I want to know, but he won't tell me! <laughs> Maybe he did think he'd killed Alita Tiala. Do I have evidence to show what he did next? Well, is this the, the standard? Stand. Yeah. Oh, God. Take that! As his next move, Dr. Maractus stole Guy Eldoon's noodle stand. What? Killing me disturbed him that much? So much he randomly stole a noodle stand? From a rival. It wasn't so it, it wasn't so random. Remember all the bowls in the clinic's foyer? And the what? <laughs> Do, <laughs> what? Do you Oh my god. Is it Oh for God's sake. Bowls that belonged in bowls that belonged inside that stand. Do you mean a foyer? Would you call it a foyer? Because that's what we call it. Really? Foyer. We yeah. call it foyer. Oh wow. Of course you call it foyer. Look, because you're fancy British people. Well, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I'm British American apparently. <laughs> bowls that belonged inside that stand. I think it's pretty obvious, don't you? That stand was at the clinic. However, the question is, why did he remove the bowls? Maybe because the stand was heavy? Actually, that's also not a bad idea. Mm. Or he wanted to They're put They're bowls, some... though! <laughs> I mean, if there's a lot of them, I don't know. Mm. Or he wanted to put something in the stand in their place. Oh. oh! Wait, you don't mean... I do. Dr. Maractus did replace those bowls with something. Your corpse, Miss Tiala! M my corpse? Dr. Maractus panicked. He thought he'd killed you. His next move would be to dispose of the body. That, that's crazy talk. You're all crazy. Not everyone has a giant vat of acid in their basement, Miss Tiala. Uh, he geez. knew he had to do something drastic. Objection! <laughs> <laughs> then let's think about it, logically. The doctor had a place to dispose of you in mind. But on his way there, who should he run into but the defendant, Waki Kataki? Objection! No, that wasn't finished. I question your logic. What's this, Prosecutor Gavin? I'm, I'm questioning his logic, Your Honor. Oh, go ahead then. <laughs> Carry on. The park is a dead end. Why would he head in that direction to begin with? That's right! He had no reason to go there! Oh, now I get because it. Because it was a haunt of... It was a trick! That spoiled brat made him do it! He made the doctor steal the stand! Objection! No, it'll be Eldoon's... It'll be Eldoon's sort of, like, place, wouldn't it? Would it where be he's just selling them? What, where, where he, just where he sets sells up. Them? Hmm. And then, obviously, that it would still look... It'd look more like Eldoon just did it and left the cart there. <laughs> Maybe. Tell me, why would someone go to a dead end? Unless the park was his destination. What? Apparently the defense has an idea. Uh, oh no, yeah, the defense yeah. should be careful because I think I can see the steam coming out of his ears. <laughs> yeah. 
His forehead is also unusually shiny. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us where Dr. Maractus was heading with the stand. Here, please, show us on this diagram. Well... Oh, no, maybe not. See, then, is that to the side? Is that a river? No, that's the road. Is it the road? It's not the road. That's the main road, isn't it? No. It's the main road. No, it's the, ri it's the river, look. Oh. The road doesn't go through the park. Oh, sorry. I wonder if he was going to try and dump it in the river. Oh, maybe then. I guess so. Uh, here, please show us on this diagram to where exactly the victim was dragging that stand. I want to say here. I, I've already saved it, but... Take that! There? Uh -huh. That's a, a... A river! Yes, Your Honor. I scarcely need to explain why. A perfect place to dispose of a body. Oh my god, she, she would meet a fate like Dahlia then by drowning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> it comes full he, circle. He was going to throw me into that river? He didn't have many other options, Fräulein. Uh, <laughs> She's like, that makes me even more glad I killed him. Oh, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I believe this clears up all of the remaining questions. Yeah, and I suppose if she went with a gun, he'll have tossed the gun in there as well and chucked it all in. I mean, God knows how he'd have managed to lift it over yeah, that Yeah, I fence, was thinking that. that. The railing, <laughs> but whatever. The oh, I suppose just dump the body, I guess. Maybe. The victim pulling the stand and the defendant before him. And inside the stand, you, Ms. Alita Tiala. <laughs> and then, the denouncement. No, no the denouement. Oh, uh, was it? <laughs> Taylor, you... Yeah, denouement. Are you kidding? No, denouement. It's the it's basically oh. the falling action. Oh, Actually, there is yeah, also there's no, there's no C as well, so it's not yeah, okay. The, the Dino, no, yeah. All right, and then the Dino Dino May, <laughs> the Dino May, Wesley Stickler of panty snatching fame walks up, seeing the two men, he shouts in that instant. Stop. Please, do not do the thing you are about to do. Mm -mm. Oh. <laughs> Bam! Ahem. Also, Dinu May, the final part of a play, movie, or narrative in which the strands of the plot are drawn together and matters are explained or resolved. The film's Dinu May was unsatisfying and ambiguous. But was it unsatisfying and ambiguous? We're gonna have to, We're find, gonna have out to find out next week. Pete, <laughs> Sarah's the timekeeper. It's okay. He saw the time. I was. Sarah literally <laughs> rose her hand. Like Sarah did the gesture she does every time. I did. Uh -huh. no, mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I just I recall being chastised because when you I because you can't see when Sarah does the gesture. <laughs> Because you aren't Can in you the same room. Can you see the gesture I'm doing right now, Pete? No, because we're not in the same room, Taylor. It's a good thing, too. Thank yeah, you very much for is. tuning in and watching, guys. If you do like what we do in these random little arguments between two of the three of us, then why not <laughs> consider giving us a like, subscribe to the channel, ring that <laughs> notification bell. You'll be notified of a video uploads every Wednesday and Saturday. And in the meantime, while you're waiting for the next episode, we've got plenty of other content on the channel. Why not go check it out? Share it with your friends. And All if, that good stuff. And if we carry on at this rate, then we'll be next. Next, Sarah will be doing a solo playthrough of <laughs> Sarah Disillusioned, Ace Attorney. Oh my God, that would be painful. <laughs> Not only for my vocal cords, but for the viewing public. Until <laughs> next time, we'll see you again. Catch you in the next one, everybody, if we're still alive. <laughs> <laughs> if Pete and I haven't eliminated each other. You were my brother, Pete! You were supposed to bring balance to the force, not destroy it! You underestimate my power. It's over, Pete! I have the high ground! <laughs> I can't remember the next line. Bye.